environment and this atmosphere in the stadium, the $80 million stadium that we have, Apogee Stadium now, we have that in place. It takes a football team, obviously, that says enough is enough, and they draw a line in the sand, and they say sooner or later in life, you need to plant your feet and take a stand and say enough is enough. And I really believe these guys behind me right now are ready to do that. And let's start doing something really positive with North Texas football. We just can't, yeah, thank you. And then it really takes, if you're going to change the atmosphere, if you're going to change attitudes, if you're going to change the culture, guess where it starts? When you step into this stadium on game day with the students, which all of you mean so much to us. Let me ask you this, how many freshmen here right now? Let me see you, let me hear you, freshmen. Yeah, oh yeah. We saw all of you in the summer. We got with 3,700 of you during orientation. And I can just picture as Rick Ken and my players and coaches and all of us what this environment is going to be like on game day on September 10th. So we're going to have some fun tonight just for a few minutes. We took this break. We call it Champions Day. We just got through listening in an hour meeting to Drew Pearson, who was just uh, nominated by Jerry Jones and elected. And he will be inducted into the Cowboys Ring of Honor in the, Cowboy, in the history of Dallas Cowboys football. He just spent an hour with our football team talking about what it takes to be a champion. And I think he might still be out here. Is he still here, guys? Up there at the entrance. How about a nice hand for Drew Pearson, number 88? Right there, guys. The best receiver to ever pull on a number 88, Drew Pearson. Thanks a lot, Drew. He came in, spent an hour with our football team. Out of the goodness, it was hard just to talk about winning in champions. But we're going to have a little fun here. Uh, I started this years ago. I talked to Rick about it. He said, you love it. Let's do it. And we're going to get the cheerleaders and dancers to pull. We just need eight students.